AITA for insisting to my husband and his parents that I need help with our kids and we need to hire someone and it's not me trying to pawn my stepdaughter off on someone else? My husband and I have three kids in our home. My stepdaughter is nine, I have known her since she was two and I became her stepmom when she was four. We also have a three-year-old son and a ten-month-old daughter together. To give some background info first, my stepdaughter's mom was not in the picture when I met my husband. She never wanted to claim any parental responsibilities and when I met my husband, his ex had accumulated a lot of child support debt and had not seen my stepdaughter since the hospital. I signed up for being a second parent and I love my stepdaughter and in my heart I consider her one of my kids just as much as my bio children. We had such a good relationship. She would sometimes call me mom, sometimes my name, but she'd always say my husband and I were her parents and she adored her brother when he was born. Over two years ago her mom came back into the picture and said she wanted to see my stepdaughter. My husband said it would need to be a gradual thing, but my stepdaughter had a right to know her. His ex didn't like that and sued for full custody, and yes, after having nothing to do with her for seven years. She lost, but this started us on a step-up plan for her to gain some custody. It's been hell. My relationship with my stepdaughter suffered badly because of all this. Her relationship with her siblings has also suffered. She is rude to me now, refuses to listen to me and rejects the three of us. It's always worse after she sees her mom. My husband took this issue to court and the judge made it clear he will never sever the relationship between mom and daughter, no matter what. I'm struggling. If I give her the time and attention needed, it comes at the cost to our younger kids. But if I focus just on them, it's not giving her the time and attention she needs and the counselor told us she needs to see I'm not going anywhere. She really emphasized that it was important. The counselor even spoke to the judge, a different one this time, and the judge said he was going to follow the previous judge's decision that contact is never to be severed between mother and daughter. My husband brought this issue back to court because it was getting worse. So now we're at a point where I can't be in charge of all three at the same time all day, especially now school is out, but even during school time it's too much. I told my husband we need to hire some sort of helper for me with the kids. He was against it and told me it was a big expense after we spend a fortune on court and therapy. His parents heard us talking about it the other day and they jumped in to say I wouldn't do this if all three were my bio kids and I just want to pawn my stepdaughter off on someone else. I insisted this was not true to all three and I insisted I needed help because the kids will suffer in the long run and so will my mental health. My husband felt guilty because I got very emotional but his parents said I just proved I wouldn't do this if they were all really mine. Ita.